It is time to begin our expressive color wheel inspired by the artist John Marin. You can use any colorful materials that you've got. Colored pencils, watercolor pencils, markers, or watercolor paint. Your art piece is going to include expressive lines, colors in the same order as the color wheel, and hidden meaningful images. Remember, anytime we can make art meaningful, it's gonna be much more special. And plus, we wanna get an A. So follow directions. First, look at your color wheel for reference. Look at John Marin's art piece to be inspired by his designs and the order of how this is created. Think color wheel. First, draw a circle in the middle of the page. Then draw three expressive images. Leave space in between each images. I chose to look back at John Marin's art piece and create buildings. You might choose to do something differently. Step two, fill in each of these images with primary colors, add shading and designs. Step three, draw images in between the first images. Make these meaningful to you. I included places I would like to go. The beach, some family's house in Virginia, and the mountains. Step four, use the correct secondary colors to fill in in between the primary colors. Again, you can use any materials that you've got, and with those materials, you can add shading, designs, and patterns. As you're creating, feel free to go back and pause so you can follow along. Okay, the final step. Complete with designs of one color or tertiary colors in the empty negative space. So if you look at those pencil drawings, that's how I chose to complete my drawing. Think of the centerpiece, the center of the circle as your happy place. Is there something you would want to add there? I can't wait to see your art. <laughs> 